welcome, Kat Ray here. So we're doing something a little bit different for this video and this project is we are over here in my neighbor's yard. This is my neighbor, Rick. He had a fire pit here and it just needed to be updated and beautified. So right here is the project we're doing for this video. Okay, so we're here at the fire pit. We got a rope. It's eight feet from the middle. We're gonna do a circle around it so it's a perfect circle. Right here, we got a lot of grass to dig up. <laughs> okay, well we are all done with the flipping this grass over. It was hard, I'm sweating pretty good. But now we're gonna get some sand put it around the edge where the brick's gonna sit on and then we're gonna get some gravel to kind of finish leveling this baby out. <laughs> okay, here comes Rick with the bricks and the fire ring. Okay, here Rick is setting up the fire ring. So Rick got our wonderful fire ring all put together. Now we're just gonna move it over there then we'll bury this baby. Let's see how oh, yeah, that sucker is hot. <laughs> I just touched it with a my forearms, like barely, it's stinking hot. Okay, so we are out here on day two. We worked so hard on the first day, just removing all that stinking hard grass. That stuff was so hard. So right now we just have to finish putting in the fire pit, get it leveled. Josh is gonna do the bricks on the outside, then we're gonna move gravel. But we'll show you this in a little more detail. Okay, so the next step to doing this is getting this level. We have this one by six and this little measure, the leveler. So we gotta make sure to bring this up so it's kind of level. But when Rick and I were digging this, we did not pay attention to the level and it is like slanted like this now. So we're gonna have to bring in some gravel, bring in that fire pit. That's our next thing to do here. Okay, so we got the fire pit all in, is centered to the best of our ability, or I should say best of Josh's ability, and then we got it leveled. So you can see all of this area, we get to bring in dirt. And then some gravel on top of it, but that's what we're working on now. So Josh is definitely the best artist around here and he is going to do the best job with the bricks around the outside, so that is his job. He will make this look perfect. Okay, so this has already taken us quite a few wheelbarrows full but we are getting this leveled. So let's keep working, my boys. Okay, so we have brought in probably six or seven wheelbarrows full. Now we just gotta measure this, make sure it's ni nice and level. Right here is perfect where we want it. Now we're just gonna move over there and try there. That looks great. Okay, we are almost done with the dirt. We have this one cart that we're gonna dump right here. 
Then we're gonna start bringing the gravel. So the gravel is in our yard. So we're driving it around in the cart and with the lawnmower to get it into the fire pit. So we have moved all of the gravel that we need from our yard over here. Now the job we're doing is bringing these stones. We went and bought these cool stones and we are moving them to make it very styly around our fire pit. So that's our job now. So we are all done with this project. I am so excited because this just looks beautiful. And like I told Rick, if he doesn't use this fire pit within the next month or two, I'm gonna go cry myself to sleep. Because we worked so hard on this thing and it looks beautiful. This thing will last forever if he keeps those weeds out. <laughs> so remember, work hard, play hard. We'll see you on the next project.